Just touched down in Vegas. This is my fifth year out here in Vegas, but it's the second year, and this year I had to bring my team because, hey, I'm trying to get Fashion League styles off the ground. Right when I hit the arena, I had to link up with my boy JR. I always got to link up with my boy. Uh, he's like one of the youngest agents out there in the world. But other than that, we had to get right to work. It's crazy because I never really looked into fashion when I was growing up. Something like that. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm working on a, my own collection right now. It's called the Judah Collection. That's what I'm doing today. So how you feel? Uh, it's crazy. Every year it gets crazy. It gets crazy and crazy, bro. Like, the experience, the network, the journey I've been through, like, bro, like I tell people all the time, like, I always wanted to go to the NBA, just being able to, like, fashion was like my door to get there. And now I'm trying to get do things with the NFL next and the WNBA, just really just, just touch every aspect, sports, with sports and doing fashion. And it's like, bro, it's like crazy that clothes got me, got me this opportunity. And it's like, bro, I'm just, just really like chasing my dreams. Like if I see it, I can believe it. You feel me? So it's a crazy, crazy experience. I'm enjoying the ride. You know, people helped me on the journey. Some people didn't help me on the journey, but hey, look, when this, when Fashion League blow up, it's it's gonna be a whole, a whole, whole big thing. I'm just, I'm just excited for the process you did. So I'm just waiting. No one knows this. This man is the ultimate G, okay? <laughs> Vanessa. Let me tell you, he can walk in a room and walk out with the whole room following behind him. That's how powerful he is. I can tell you how much. Here, check it out. <laughs> so this is my whole team. Oh, team. How you doing? <laughs> so, and I'm also recording for my documentary. I'm doing team. So, one day, we... Fashion League Styles gonna be on 2K. I've been claiming that for years. You just keep at it. Here's the deal. It's all about tenacity. Mm. It's all about tenacity. It's the only thing that really makes a difference because if you keep doing it and keep doing it, one day they're gonna see you. Yeah. yeah, you can take a picture of it, sure. What the heck? So the, this has like 70 something cameras. We do a full wow. 360 of them all at once and then they stitch that together mm. and then they make a um a, you know like a mold of that and that's how yeah. they put them in the game and they have them say all these different things like they have yeah, to make these yeah, yeah. different movements with their mouth and that's what makes them talk in the game mm. and set up fair i was going to shout out Van Van styles huge things going on i was there four or five years ago man the boy grind is stayed down he's get everything he worked for deserve for I'm proud of you as hell man you, you're doing your thing, man. You're right. doing your thing. I'm watching. I'm staying with you all the time, bro. It's awesome. I'm, I'm extremely happy for you. I'm proud of you. You put the work in for real. You Appreciate put the work it. in. You're still putting the work in. And, and you're, seeing, you're reaping the rewards right now. And right. that's how it's supposed to go, man. Right. That's how it's supposed to go. I know. So I was like, awesome. this year and then next year, bro, this shit going crazy. I'm just... I'm oh, just, you already know. I'm just excited. Like, it, just keep, it just keeps elevating. It just keeps elevating. Look, all I'm saying, look, when I get that PJ, it's over. Hey, yeah, they, 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 they gonna have to When I get ready, it's a process. It is a very process. It takes me two hours to get ready. I get take longer than a female, but I really get it from my dad by him being in the Marines. And when they get ready and put on a dress blues, like it's a whole process. It's a whole. When I'm in summer league and stuff, I think I pray the most <laughs> because I'm I'm asking God to just let doors just keep being opening for me and let an opportunity to keep following in my laps. And just sometimes I be having them days where I just be wanting to give up, but I just know like everything wouldn't happen without him, so. You just get us through there. You know what we need today, Lord Jesus, to be successful. And I ask you to just watch over us and make it happen. In your name I pray, amen. 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 The Tunnel Fits, what do you go to? You're gonna try new or something that you got coming up with. Um, I just, different colors, I try to match colors with my shoes. Oh, I put my watermark on all of my photos to protect it when I'm on the internet. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I definitely want to do like an on-court brand and an off-court brand. So once, once that NBA season hits, I got, I got plenty of stuff in my closet. Uh, we definitely here come season time. We definitely put some on. You know, keep your fashion up. You know, cause everybody out here fashion is, 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 is like that. I ain't gonna lie. You gonna be looking like me trying to figure something out. Hey, what's up, man? This person is chill up. Play for the Toronto Raptors. Pooping in. Um, uh, I wasn't saying my Kobe's any pair until like me. 
um, the museum. You know, my, my, my partners, Mo and G, they're, they're, I wear their brand a lot. Um, you know, black owned business. What's up, y'all? Tyler Hero, guard from the Miami Heat. Make sure y'all tap in with Fashion League yeah. Styles. Listen, y'all. This man right here is probably, no, it's the goaded trainer. The goaded finishing, connection, everything. Fashion League Styles wouldn't exist without his participation. Also, he really put the style in Van Styles. You know, you, you got Kenny Styles, okay? That's, <laughs> that's the distant cousin, the part of the family you did. Listen, Kenny, you want to tell anybody how awesome we are? Because I don't, I don't think they understand. I don't think we really have to say anything. Look, I, mean, I think it's just the presence, the presence. The, so, uh, uh, look, look, and that smile lets you know it's time to eat, boy. <laughs> Every morning we on the prayer. We on the prayer every morning. Come on, look, prayer call. We right got now. prayer call every morning. Rock, where you at? Hey, I they, got the listen, Bible. They tried to stop us. It didn't work. It didn't work. Mm -hmm. yeah. If you, if you, if you on this team, you can't, you can't even say God ain't real. Cause look, <laughs> look, I ain't lying. look, you can't say. Anything. I gotta say, summer league, twenty three, one of the most. Craziest, on the edge, chills down my back, experience of a lifetime. Was able to accomplish more than what I expected this year. Like, bro, I could, words can't even describe. Like, I'm just ready to get back to H, put everything together. We're not gonna let you do this shit by yourself, you hear me? We're gonna fucking do this shit together. <laughs> We got goals and we're gonna finish that shit. I promise you that. I'm not gonna let you fail. Lou, they're not gonna let you fail. We're gonna do this shit, nigga. You hear me? You hear me? Yeah. Shit happened for a reason. It's your time to take over, king. You a king. You're not a prince no more. You're a fucking king. You hear me? You hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is a blessing, bro. This is a fucking blessing. Yeah. This is a blessing. This is a blessing, bro. This is the shit that we was doing, bro. Your mama made this shit happen. Your mama, we didn't make this shit happen. Stay on your toes. Let's go, boy. Let's go. Oh, man, bro. Let's go, boy. I gotta put the glasses on for sure. Y'all got me out here crying, bro. But no, it's just crazy. Just like, I just never thought, like, it would get, like, to this level at all like just at all like i had to bruh no the fuck ain't not they gonna wait this is shot talk your shit hey come on get in there get in there yeah. everybody get in there my whole life i've been bottling emotions i never had a dad that i could say i was close with he died in jail over some whole shit and i never got to tell him i need him i'm still broken I'm glad you know it's always dead. <laughs> it's always dead. Look, look, look. Since you on FaceTime until I get you in person, you gotta you gotta say something what's up to the doc. You gotta say some shit to the documentary. Shit, everything a long time coming, man. Ain't ain't nothing but blessings to God. Mama upstairs, you know what I'm saying? Trying to put our family in better positions. That's all it is, man. All glory to God. Uh -huh. Yeah, come on. How to him? You good? Talk to him, bro. Yes, sir. Talk to him. Come on. Uh, uh. Yeah, bro. No. Nah, I'm trying not to. If you understand what, if you if you understand what we had to go through all weekend to get all these interviews, bro. For years, bro. Years, facts. Talk about it. Oh yeah, bro. Come on, give us something. We all got the waterworks going. Yeah, just shit, shit just happens how it's supposed to. Bro, everybody is doing their part, trying to contribute to something greater than ourselves. We got people above us watching over us, make this shit happen. Yeah, about to make shit, this shit, just going to court. This shit, it's above us, bro. It's not, it's, it's not in our hands. We just know what we're supposed to do. That's it, bro.
I love you. I'm proud of you.